He did that, they be bouncing them checks, but I don't really mind when they bouncing them checks. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be. Hey, everybody, welcome to another Worst of Bass. So, this should be going up on July 6th. This is finally Big Brother. I have been working on this video for like three months. Like I've been watching all the seasons, this, that, and the third. Um, I'm gonna try to keep this short and sweet. Okay, and 23rd, because I know season 24 is coming out when this come out, but I'm just not reviewing that one, okay? So season 21, um, I just didn't really like it, okay? Season 17. I didn't like that one either because they had kept having people coming back from other seasons. Didn't like it. Next, move on. Season 15. This is the one with the racial issue. Not Rachel, but the racial issue where Aaron and Candace and Gina Marie and Amanda was like saying all these racial things about the Asian people and the black people. The reason I put, I love the upgrade of the show, like how it looked and everything. But the only reason why this season is going to be this rank so low is the racism. I like the cute little relationship between Amanda and McCray. Even though the relationship didn't work out, okay? Alyssa had got voted too many times to be the thing. Now, I think that was kind of rigged because, you know, she's Rachel's sister and they love Rachel, okay? Um, and 20th place is season one. It, for me, it was kind of slow. I still have yet... Because, you know, if you if you want to watch, Paramount Plus has all 23 seasons. And, of course, they'll have season 24 as well. It was kind of just slow to me. Like, I didn't like the way it looked because, you know, your girl, I love HD TV. I love HD. It was kind of slow and it didn't get to the meat of the season to the middle. And it was really unwatchable for me. Season 10, this is when Dan won, okay? Rennie and Jesse were an interesting pair to watch. That was for sure. Um, I think, think Keisha was on this season. Not really much to say about this season. Moving on. Season 14, it just seemed like the same three people were HOH. If you watch the show, you know what I'm talking about. And, like, they couldn't get anybody else or, like, nobody else was, like, really capable of playing the game right. Season 18, I like that Josh won and Paul lost twice. Like, that's just what you get. You thought that you was going to be the puppet master of everything, and you just ended up being the puppet master of nothingness, okay? In season 16, it was nice to see an older man make it really far. And, of course, the person who won, very predictable. Um, Season 2, uh, I think this was where Will and... Mike Boogie became friends. Um, don't really have nothing to say about this season. Season 22, this was the second Big Brother All-Stars. And I personally liked the first one better. Because they had to replace the music like from season one. I don't really like season one's music that well. And they did it in season 23 too. So I hope in this next up in this coming season that is coming out today, I guess. When y'all are watching this because I'm still filming this in June. Um, that it have the regular music that I used to have. And, you know, because of COVID, they used pictures for the intro. And it's a little slow. It was nice to see Bailey on there. Um, again, I can't remember who won because I still have not. I've watched the season before, but I forgot who won. Season 8. Like, y'all thought I was going to do pictures for this one. Like, this, this, this show was too long. And I was thinking of doing The Simpsons, but girl, girl, boy. Whoever is watching, like, it's just too long. It's too long, okay? Um, Let me see. Season 8 was the one with Dan. Oh, yeah. Danielle and her dad. Um, I think that was, um, let me see. Dick won this one. Okay, so Dick won this one, and his daughter was runner-up, I guess. And, um, again, I don't remember much from this season either. Big Brother season 11. So, season 11, Jordan won. It was kind of a surprise because, you know, she only had won one HOH. I think her now husband um, won something. I loved their love story. Wow, why does my iPad keep crashing? Um, I love that their love story was on there. And uh, who else? Like, the house guests. Okay, so there was Natalie. Kevin was in third place. I remember now. Um, 
there was Russell, Ronnie. Oh my goodness, Ronnie was a trip, okay? Cause he thought that he was gonna win the whole thing, but he was like playing both sides or whatever. Like you wasn't gonna get anywhere. And y'all remember when Shima threw her mic in the water and had to be sent home? I was like, wow, girl, you done did it. You done did it. So we're at, of course, I'll be putting the rankings on the scene, I, on screen. I know this is gonna take some major editing. Okay, season seven was, I believe it was the All-Stars, was that season nine? Mm. Yeah, that's kind of weird, like it was the All-Star season? Yeah, 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 okay, it was the All-Star season with Boogie winning and Erica being the runner-up. He played her like a dog, you know, as a couple. Janelle, like she had got right off her season Oh, I forgot to say, she was on the other Big Brother All-Stars, but she got eliminated so much earlier than she did on this one. And, like, um, there's that. And Will was trying to play Janelle. And, you know, Nokomis, she got evicted fairly quickly. And, you know that? This, that, and the third. And Kaser, to me, he just can't win the game. Like, he just can't win. Okay, season three was with Marcellus and um, Danielle. Again, the older seasons kind of were too slow for me. Moving on. Um, season 19. Okay, so season 19 was the summer of temptation. And there was, oh, I like this one. Okay, this was with Christmas and, and Cody. Um, there was a chance to bring people back. This is where Jessica met her man, Cody. They're still together to, to this day. I think they got like three kids. They met on a show. They were boyfriend, girlfriend. I thought that was really cute. Cameron didn't even get a chance to get in the house. Like, I remember that. No. And then Paul, you know, Josh wasn't on there twice. I don't know how to fix that in editing. But anyways, I love that Josh won this season. I think I got something good. Okay, Big Brother season four. I really started watching it like when I went to rewatch. When I went to rewatch the show, I started with season five, and I've just been jumping around. I'm watching season twenty three right now because I can't remember who won. So Big Brother season four, Jun Song was the only one that I feel like in um, Chinese descent. Um, didn't really care for this season. Like, um, or I think this is the one where they had the X's. The X's, mm -hmm. but I didn't really care for this season. Um, I'm not really going to be ranking them all this time because there are too many seasons to rank, period. Okay, Big Brother season six is the one. Love Janelle. I, I was actually rooting for Janelle because she was winning comp after comp after comp. I thought she was going to win the whole thing, but who? Maggie ended up winning. That was like Maggie and Yvette. And like, nah. No, nah, I didn't really care. Um, then there's Big Brother season 12. I haven't watched that one fully, but I might watch that over again. Because this is where Rachel and Brendan met. They are currently having their own little show on one of those um, apps, you know, site things. Um, yeah, overall, I have not watched the whole thing. Like, I watched it a long time ago, but I couldn't remember. Okay, fifth place is season five. I love that Michael found his sister, Nicomis. Um, This season was crazy. Um, then there was that girl that dated the winner and like they, they you would have thought they would stay together, but he didn't take her to the end. He ended up taking Michael to the end. Okay. Season 13. Season 13. Season 13 was a season, um, Portia was a runner up and of course Rachel finally got her win. I think she was the first one. Wait, Portia was runner up. She made it that far. I'm going to have to watch that season again. I didn't know that. Um, and this is where Danielle and Dick came back, you know, as, I don't know, like the returning house guest and Rachel won that season. Like she was the first girl to break the streak of the guys winning so much because I think they hadn't had a girl winner since like season four, I think. So overall, that was a good season. 
Um, season 20, I love the showmances. Season 20, I love the showmances. Love the winner. She fought so hard. Season 23, the season I'm watching, right? I loved it because it was the first season to have more than three black people. It's nice to see yourself on TV, okay? And it was nice to see a black winner because they never had one in all 23 seasons. We had to get to Celebrity Big Brother to have Terry Moore Braxton win. You know, like that was good. I love the show. I love that they gave the theme song a little edge, okay? And like, of course, they got the older guy out quickly because he played the game a little too hard. Like, I forgot his name at the moment, but he played a little too hard, okay? And then season nine, I love this season because they're like a couple together. I love like Amanda and the other guy, even though she had got sick. And then the other girl had got sick with the EpiPen. And like, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this. Whew. I'm going to have a hard time in editing because I got to get a picture of each season. And um, yeah, a war works the best to come. Somebody brought up an idea, doing a word now. That's going to take a lot of time and editing and research and all that, this and that and third. So I'll probably be doing that in August because I think in August I'm going to take a break from the worst to best since I'm giving y'all 31 days of worst to best. But I'll see y'all next time. Bye.